All right, welcome back to another exciting episode, everyone. Uh, so we are on top of my buddy's house. This is his roof that we worked on many years ago. And as you can see, we have a little bit of a, we have some problems developing right here. And what we want to do today is we're going to cut out a four by eight piece of this deck. And we are going to replace it with a fresh planking and and then waterproof it so should be a, a very straightforward and exciting time we're going to initially we're just going to take out one panel so that way we won't have too much to fix since the problem is right there we're going to take out this outermost panel just three feet and whisk so we're using these boards as a guide so when we run the blade we'll get a true straight edge and that's not going to help out now, but it's going to help out later when we have to reinstall a new sheet. We don't want to install into like a jagged setup. sunken cavity as you can see some of the beams are, are damaged so we're gonna have to sister them up and probably put some uh, either two by fours or two by sixes right here extend them out to the fascia and replace the rest of the deck and then reinstate the deck with a new plywood plywood in addition to that um, we're gonna have to use a lot of asphalt to mend the seams behind between the good Good moisture barrier and bad moisture barrier. Now, uh, I don't know if you can get a shot of the moisture barrier right there. There are six layers on this roof, which is a little unorthodox, but you know, understandable. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna try and fix that today. And all six of them failed. <laughs> all right, so we're back. Uh, we're getting close to our four-hour mark, and as you can probably tell from here uh, we've sistered a lot of the rotten wood and created a, a, a frame that will leverage off of the good 
structure, the good portion of the beam, towards the back. All right, we're using these B feet, uh, five inch screws. So uh, it should be sufficient. The quality of the speed for itself. <laughs> I don't know if I love this. 